right, Tom, so I got to ask you, man, growing up, who were some of your favorite players? Honestly, now that we're in Texas, but it was Corey Seager. Um, I grew up in Southern California, and you go to a lot of those Quakes games, the minor league games, and Seager was there at the time. And honestly, I toe-tapped at the time because of him. And just growing up watching him, it was fun. I love it. I love it. So if you could do the Mount Rushmore of your position, you need four players all time in your mind, like even if, if it's generational now, whatever, mm -hmm. who would be your Mount Rushmore for your position? Oh man, I would go Derek Jeter, definitely up there. Mm -hmm. um, and Cal Ripken, just mm -hmm. ridiculous. It still blows my mind how many games we played in a row. Yeah. Um, oh man, I'm gonna go sneaky pick. Oh man. It's getting tough, man. It yeah. is getting tough. Yeah. I'm gonna Let's go Ozzy Smith. Okay. I know he's second base second baseman, but I like his glove. Yeah. And then I'm gonna go last. Let's go. I'm gonna say Raphael for call. I grew up a okay. big I, I grew up Braves. a big yeah. Okay. I watched him growing up too and he was one of my favorite players. I love that, I love that. So I gotta ask you, man, the first time you saw yourself on a video game. It will be the show, obviously. Mm -hmm. What did you think? Because I'm pretty sure growing up, you had to create yourself. Yeah. But to see you on a video game, what did you think? I, I'm a big I'm be the show fan. I played a lot. I still play to this okay. day. And when I first saw my, my face, I'm like, this this is it. Like, it doesn't get better than this. Yeah. It's, you don't have to create your, your own face and kind of make it look not like you. It, but it, it's real. It's, it's your face. I love it. So, how many, like, I'm pretty sure with the Diamond Dynasty and stuff like that, how often do you hear from fans and stuff that, oh man, I got you on Diamond Dynasty, oh man, I love you on even be the show. Does that happen a lot? I've had, it's happened a few times. I play a few Diamond Dynasty games and they're like, hey, it's more so like, it's great, great response. It's yeah. like, hey, um, best of luck this season, like huge fan of you. And uh, mm -hmm. you know, those guys I respect so much. I mean, it's, it's cause I, I was kind of the other way around just mm -hmm. playing to play. Yeah. And, now it's like, hey, I'm actually in the game and I can play against other people. So. I love it. I love that. I love that. So I'm pretty sure you saw Edwin Diaz in this walk-up song in the theme. I got to ask you this. Let's just say song is named after you. You got any artist do the song. Oh, man. And that's your walk-up song. Yeah. And somehow, some way, there's a day where they have MLB has a day where the artist comes to the park and performs a song. Who would you want to do your song? Oh, man. Ooh, that's a tough one. You know, I would, honestly, I would do any Drake song. Drake, I'm listening to Drake, I, I like I like his okay. vibe and stuff. So I would just any Drake song. I like Drake that. for sure. I like that. I like that. So the moment that you got called up, obviously big deal for you. Um, what would you say is your first I'm here moment in the major leagues? Like was it a player that you saw on the other team? I'm even going in your club out seeing a Jose Ramirez type. What was your first like? Man, I'm actually here moment. Yeah. So our team does a great job, like yeah. kind of grooming guys. To like be ready for that yeah. moment and uh you know before we would actually go to the stadium and kind of like take it in so when i first got there and then when i stepped on the field and saw all the fans mm -hmm. that was the first time like playing in the stadium mm -hmm. with fans i was like wow i made it I, i'm here and then seeing my family in the stands too made it even icing on the cake that's 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 amazing so gotta ask you man back to like sort of like the video game talk you know in the video game world we call it chicos certain players are just chicos when you see a guy that can hit 40 home runs and also pitch, and we're talking about Shoyo Tani. Oh, yeah. What comes to your mind, man? Because, like, I mean, this is, like, something that we have never seen. Yeah. What do you think about that as a player? Because, I mean, growing up, you probably thought, man, we never would probably get a guy that could do both, but there's somebody doing it. You know, you see him in real life compared to the video game. Yeah. Video game, you're like, yeah, he's a pretty big player. Yeah. But when you see him in person, it's ridiculous how big he is. Mm -hmm. And it's like he throws 99. He hits 40 home runs. Mm -hmm. It's it's just something. It, it's a creative player. It really is. And then just like I said, playing against against him this year, it was it was crazy. And uh, you know, seeing playing him in a video game, he is a cheat code. I, I, mean. love, I love it. <laughs> true, true, true. So man, you know, I guess we get into with two questions here. So let's say, okay, this is a finale view question. Today. I'll, I'll make it like this. What is your favorite baseball movie? Movie. Okay, I'm gonna go with the OG Sandlot. I like that. Yeah. I'm glad you said that. So yeah. let's just say. They want to do a Sandlot 2023, and they want to have you in the movie, but you can't be in the movie. Who would you want to play you in the movie as an actor? Actor, I'm going to go, oh man, since he's always in all the baseball movies, I'm going to go Kevin Costner. I like that, I like that, yeah. I like that. I know he's a little older, but hey, we, we, can, we can more. CGI, CGI, CGI can work. Okay, I like that. <laughs>
I like that. I like that. So last question, man, with this Guardian team, man, obviously you've been been in, I guess you could say, your first quote unquote year. Mm-hmm. Um, you're in a playoff push. And I'm pretty sure it's exciting for you. What do you see in this team, man? Because y'all got a bunch of, I mean, you, Steven, Tristan, just different young guys, even with some of the veteran guys like Jose. What do you see in the potential of this team, man? It, we're, we're fun to watch, for sure. And I'm, we're having so much fun while doing it, too. It's, uh, you know, our environment is so close, and we're all close with each other. It's You can't really break our bond right now. And it's, uh, you know, we're, we're having fun. We're hoping, uh, hope, we're hoping to win a lot of a lot of these playoff games. And, uh whether we go all the way, you know, it's, it's whatever it's going to be, it's going to be a fun ride. Oh, man, good luck the rest of the way, man. Hopefully by this time next year, me and you will be laughing and joking about how you guys actually got a championship, man, out of this, man. Or yeah. if not, man, I hope that much success to you going for, man. Appreciate, Appreciate your you. time now. Thank, Thank you. you.